So what is up, y'all? Welcome back to Morning Cars Review. I'm back at it, man. It's been a while since I last um, did a video for you guys, but now I'm here. Today's a holiday. Today is um, Columbus Day, actually. So this tells you that this video is a recent one. It might not come out. Um, I might not um, upload it on the holiday, but at least you have a, you have an idea that it was actually made recently. So. Today I'm all about trucks. There's a lot of trucks behind me. So let's jump in it and focus on the trucks. So this one is a Ram 2500. This is a HD. Frame rock. Hmm. Okay. You have this, um, does this one do it? I don't think so. I think it, it retracts, right? This um yeah this should should um flip into a trader um if you're towing for a toy mode. $1,850. You have this um flatbed in the back. This is actually for a fifth wheel, so I guess it actually was used for towing. You have good tires, you have a rotted frame, and it's visible, you can tell. Okay, if you buy this guy. You ain't gonna do a lot of towing on it. I can tell you that for a fact. This is how it looks from the back. Let's go ahead and take you on the other side. There are a lot of rocks. You can tell. Let me take you guys underneath. Yep. The chow season is all it's all rotted. So um this is how it looks. This is a work truck. So you have storage on the here okay you actually have storage on the here too all right okay it's not going down english nah So you have a red seat, okay? Let's climb in this girl. Um, 175,000 on the miles, which is not bad for a truck like this. Okay, uh, interior is actually clean. Um, I don't know if this is a backup camera. My guess is yes. Um, it was actually detailed before it came in, so that's why it's clean. And the guys actually did their best. They did their 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 utmost best they clean it up okay put okay so we have um power seats which is good and it works okay it's opened um before we open the hood let's go ahead and show you guys so you have the bracket for the snow plow fog lights okay and this is how it looks from the side so let's go ahead and Lift up this thing. Where is it? Where is it, guys? Where is the hood release? Okay, hold up. Let me figure this out and I'll come back. Well, for some reason, it doesn't want to open, so um, I'm not going to know what's going on under there. This stuff is broken and I can't get my hands past the screw, so. That's how it is. We have some scraping of stuff on it. Good wheels, good tires. Okay. And we're going to call those on a wrap, guys. Let's go ahead and look at another one. So right next to it is a GMC. Okay. With for $950. It says broken frame. So Chelsea's is all broken up. You can actually tell that it is from right here. You see the gap? See my fingers? You see the hole? It's getting bigger, it's getting bigger, and it gets bigger. So, something happened here. Um, it's a Z71. You have the the um, bed ramp stuff on it. You tow stuff on top of it. It's actually a work truck. You have the tow package. Okay. We have the bed liner. All star. Let's go ahead and look at the other one. The cargo rack. Okay. 
Yep, this is it. Yep, this is how it looks. Okay. This one is done. Okay, if you're getting it, probably you're getting it for um, the engine. Maybe you want to strap it or whatever. But this is good. This is not, not a good one. I we'll have um, wires. Okay, this is the... This is actually the cool cap. Okay. This is... um. This is the extended cap, okay. I don't know if this one opens. It does. Okay, so, GMC be tripping y'all. So, this side is not open, that side opens. So, um, we have the, it has a four wheel drive system, which is nice. Let's go ahead and pop that hood. Show you guys what is it. Maybe a five seven. Five point three vortex. Engine looks actually um okay from this side it looks clean, but you have a whole lot of um oil and stuff going on over there. But it is it this is it, um nine hundred and fifty dollars gives you that one let's go ahead and look at another one so i mean i was tempted to look at this one it's actually rough to be honest but it looks real good with these tires good good thread on the tires by the way it's an exterior right? it goes for five thousand eight hundred fifty dollars um the pin is actually rough i don't know if they repainted it but um it's no good it has the tow package nope is it locked I have no idea about that. We will find out real soon. It's actually maybe somebody is interested in it. I wasn't going to review anyways, but it looks so cool with the off-road tires. So I decided to say, you know what? Let's go ahead and look at it. But this is how it looks. It's an exterior. It's not a Pro 4X. It's a regular exterior with the um, four-wheel drive option. So let's go ahead and look at another one. Okay, we've seen this one. This one been here forever. Okay. There's some cars on the lot that will just not sell, no matter how. What is this, bro? There was some cricket um, came flying on me. It's trying to get up. I remember doing this one too. The VA Triton is still here since I last left. This one, I'm not too sure. So we're gonna take a look at it. Um, it's an XL, so my guess this should be probably the V6. Let's go ahead and walk around here. It has very good tires. Um, two thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars. We have some body stuff that was done here and resprayed. Trying to save it, I don't know. Okay, let's go ahead and take you guys in the back. This is how it looks from the back. This is a single cab with the long bed. So this is pretty much good. We have a couple of rust going on um, in the um, in the bed. Nothing too bad. Let's go ahead and take you guys inside. All right. These are all work trucks, by the way, guys. So you don't expect anything exciting on these ones. You have the manual crank windows. Um, you have the inside. Uh, what is this? I don't know. Um, this one does not have a... F um, okay, this one has four-wheel drive. I was just about to say it does not have four-wheel drive. And then I saw it. So let's go ahead and pop that hood. Show you guys what's going on here. It's an F-150. This is the XL. My guess is this one is Ford. Man, these cars, man. Where are they released? Okay, this one's right down here. Okay. All right. Oh, this is a 4.6 liter V8. My bad, guys. I made a big, I made a big mistake. Sorry about that. The phone fell from my hands. Engine looks good. Um, sells it. It's probably been riding on some 
um, road construction stuff. Did I take you guys around this side? No, this is how it looks from the side. Um, it's not specify any any known problems. So it's a four point four point six liters, guys. Yep, that's a big one. Let's go ahead and look at another one. Another truck. Sorry about the wind noise, guys. But it is, it is what it is. This is an open lot. And you find these things. Um, a Ford Ranger XLT. $2,450 with the bed cover. Couple of rust going on every, every, every side of this truck. You have, um, I wouldn't want to call this a tow package. There's something they have for this thing. Um, you don't go and put too many, that kind of a heavy weight on it. It's gonna rip this whole bumper apart. I just don't know the name of it, but it's some name they have for it. This is how it looks. Okay, from the back. Okay. All right. This is um, this is a single cabin, or probably an extended cabin, something like that. Um, this is how it looks. You have your one cubby. It's actually filthy in here very very much filthy um take you guys around this one has been here forever too yep you have the manual crank windows let's pop that hood okay 84 um 184,000 on the dash that's what it says 184 grand on the miles that's what it says not too sure about that this is um a 2003 ranger xlt so this pickup belongs to the 4.0 single overhead cam group sohc As you can tell engine looks good okay um bumper is all off and this is how it looks from the side let's go ahead and look at the nut now thanks for watching this video guys um hope you enjoyed the content that i create hope you um enjoy the videos of the trucks hope you enjoy every single bit of the the um the minutes and the seconds of this video um do me a favor guys hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber um like the video comment share you know make your comments your comments are actually 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 important to me um tell me what you would like to see tell me the stuff that you actually want to see me do and i would definitely um try my best to create a content like that let me know if you like the short videos or the long videos let me know all of those good stuff um if i'm making a mistake on these cars let me know as well okay i will always um give a shout out to the um the subscriber who corrected me about the crew the crew cap and the you know the regular cap i didn't know okay so we all learn from um from each other so do me a favor again um hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber like the video share you know comment um whatever you want to comment negative positive um you know criticize and stuff they're all okay they're all welcome um i read the comments um you know and i learn a lot from them so um i'm my apologies guys i haven't been doing you guys content um as frequent or as consistent as i used to be that's because um you know for now youtube is not paying guys you know what i'm saying i have a full-time job that i have to do i have a family to support you know what i'm saying so um until you know the channel gets uh monetized and stuff like that until i can get paid you know then you know i can you know decide and make this thing a full-time but for now i'm doing it because it's what i love to do i love cars i love to be around cars and um seeing the seeing the channel you know growing um over the over the, the last uh, few months gives me the idea that you guys to love you know you know you you love cars and you love what i do so it just motivates me to to do it more and makes me to, to know that you know i have people um that love what i love so it actually uh gives me that positive drive to do what i gotta do but some um you're gonna see some um, inconsistencies in the videos I'm not going to be dropping videos as often 
as I used to, you know, because I have um, more hours to work down on until this YouTube, YouTube um, channel or this YouTube stuff starts to pay off. That's how it's going to be, guys. Hope you understand that. But for now, let's jump into this thing, man. I'm here. I did a lot of video. I've been here since 9 o'clock this morning. And I'm doing a lot of videos so I can be able to upload it over the time. So let's go ahead and call this one a wrap. I'm off. And I'll see you guys again in the next one.